Texas voters, you still have an hour to make your voice heard at the ballot box. Good evening, I'm Richard Ransom. And I'm Katina Rankin. Tens of thousands of voters are deciding a host of races, including Memphis mayor, city council, and whether to raise the sales tax to restore police and fire benefits. A lot to consider tonight. Elections uh, leaders are reporting no major or minor issues so far today. Local 24 News reporter Brad Broders is live at one of the historically busy precincts in East Memphis. Brad? Well, Richard and Katina, so far so good here at Second Baptist. Poll workers here tell me the votes so far today on this election day are outpacing those that are in the last city election in 2015. That message also being shared by those at other precincts across the city of Memphis. Now, this afternoon, I visited three precincts, both in Cordova and in East Memphis. Precinct leaders there each reported either a steady or solid stream of voters throughout the day added the typical post-work surge, which we're in right now. The Shelby County Elections Administration anticipates as many, if not slightly more voters, will participate today compared to the entire early voting period. Election leaders are hopeful for a voter turnout of close to 30% or 30% of eligible voters. Both first-time and long-time Memphis voters said this local election made their vote even more significant. It's crucial. I mean, it's a smaller populace in the federal, so it's your vote matters more than it does there. And, uh, it impacts you more because it's closer to you. They do most of the work for our own city, so this, this is a must. People should come and vote for city. They don't, but they should. Now, Shelby County elections leaders did report some minor issues before voting started this morning, including a printer which had to be restarted at a voting location in Orange Mound. Computer techs are on standby if any issues emerge during this last hour of voting. Reporting live in East Memphis, Brian Broders, Local 24 News. Right.